Hello Ratbags, it's Jay Plays Games. Welcome to a celebration video of 20,000 subscribers. Thank you guys for getting me to 20,000 subscribers. It's the second time I've recorded this because the camera went all dodgy. But I did want to say a big thank you to everyone. It was really important to get my face in as well when I say thank you to people because it's, it's important. Um, sorry, I've said some coke. Um, thank you, thank you everyone that's been supporting me, getting me to 20,000 subs, you know. It's just as important as getting new subs is getting people to watch you. And I've got such a good core of people that watch me continuously or come back and watch lots of my videos and lots of my content. So a big shout out to you first, you know. And then all the new subs that have been joining, I hope you're enjoying the content. I hope you're finding something you like. Um, or yeah, I'm just keeping you up to date with what's going on. What I plan to do in the future short sharp and sweet is do a celebration video properly i've got something in mind something different it's coming soon very soon very special i don't do normal stuff like q and a's or challenges well sometimes i don't know if you guys wanted a q and a let me know and I'll, maybe i'll do one um but i just like doing something a bit different a little bit interesting if you don't know what i'm talking about go and check out 15,000 subscribers you'll see what i did there and for 10,000 subscribers we've done a charity live stream so i'll try and do things differently um but i just want to say a big shout out and everyone that supports me my whole team Everyone that runs my channel in terms of the admins on my channel, big shout out to you lot. You know, there's lots of people that support me. There's lots of people that don't necessarily get a chance to comment as much or help me moderate my channel, but they do support me anyway, so a big shout out to them. But these people here are generally the people that really comment a lot or really help monitor my channel and keep it fresh and keep the community going. Some fake nations, some guy on a bike, Prince Guzman, Shadowhawk, Runs With Pencil, David Mizzen, Oliver Wright, Juicy Bear, Virgil Gaming, Missy Prime, Royal Star Gaming. It doesn't mean more anyone else is special there's other people that help me um they just maybe do different jobs or they do different things or have got different strengths but these are the people that comment the most or help me out the most in comment sections or just support me in other ways as well so big shout out to them big shout out to everyone that follows me on twitter as well i've got a few people on twitter that constantly like retweet me and and you know show me some love I'm also on Instagram. Go and give me a follow on Instagram. I generally just show bits and bobs to my kids, my personal life. So if you're interested in any of that lot, you can go and check it out. And on my Facebook page as well. My Facebook page is there. You know, go and give it a like. I share loads of different videos and I'll share other people's stuff. I share game related info about all sorts of games and, and interesting things. So go and check all them pages out. You know, it was only the 4th, 5th of February that we was on one fit no, we was on 15,700 subs. So we're on 20,000 now in like a month and a half. It was only December we was on 10,000 subs. So the growth has been phenomenal. Um, I've got to keep that going though. And Ark is, seems to be plateauing a little bit. I can see lots of the views kind of just coming down and just being a little bit average. Um, and that's why I've been looking at other content and I enjoy doing other content. So I'm carrying on with Conan Exiles, but I'm still going to do an Ark video every single day. Um, and all sorts of things going on with art. In fact, I'm not probably doing more than one a day. I've got big plans for the previews and the mods, hopefully the ones that might come to console. I'm doing my Tame series because I want it for launch. I want some of my content to be not remembered because I don't think anyone's going to necessarily go and watch all my content or watch my videos in a year's time. But I would like a playlist with a lot of videos in it and that could be something that people recognise as my stuff you know when you see it in the description bar a lot of my thumbnails are always different I've never had the same style I think they're boring I mean that's okay but if on this thing when I've done it I felt like it was a bit boring um, I like the Thames at least because it shows like a really good uh, it's colourful and bright and I'd like my tame series to be something that people sort of remember me a little bit for you know they're just throw away little videos they're not meant to be like in depth totally 100% this is exactly what you should be doing they're just little guides to remind you what great creatures there are in Ark and I've got loads of content I'm going to carry on doing I'm still going to do some tutorials and guides on Ark I still want to do my A to Z by the time it launches I will have the A to Z of Ark completed I will not be doing any more Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, it's a good game. I can sink some hours into it. I have done off camera as well. But ultimately, if the views aren't there, there's other stuff I can be doing. And I'll just play it at my leisure rather than feeling like I've got to play it every day to do a video on it. And going back to Hunters, I've done six episodes. I've got another four episodes to go. Um, really good episodes as well. And then that's it. I'm going to have a break after 10. I'm going to leave it for season two there. And season three will pick up when I've got a bit more time.
I've had a few weeks off, last few weeks off work, um, personally, just because I've been a bit down and a bit moody, and just not been right, um, and so doing YouTube, I've been able to just stay at home and do YouTube, because I've not felt like going out, which is good, because it means I'm getting stuff done, but on the other hand, it means I've got to sort myself out, and I've got to go back to work, so I'll be doing that, so some of my content might drop a little bit, you might not see as many videos, but for the meantime, I'm going to be banging out two or three videos every day. And yeah, going forward, it's going to be Ark and Conan mostly. Um, I've got my second channel running. Go and give that a follow. I'll leave the link down below. There's all sorts of content coming out for that. I'm doing more content this weekend on it. I've got Lego at the moment. I've got loads of different playlists from my other channel, from when, you know what other games I've played. So all sorts of things. I plan to be doing Slime Rancher this weekend. Loads of games, loads of different things coming out. Terraria in the future. And I say this a lot, but really take notice of some smaller youtubers and people that are around your level you know always try and promote people i think my community is one of the best communities out there for my channel my size or people doing the same sort of stuff as me you know we get more comments on the videos i'll get more community people talking to each other and supporting each other as well if they're youtubers even if they're not youtubers but this section is my recommended and i always try and find new talent or new people um, and lots of them barely have not even got 100 subscribers apart from Stevie he's got thousands because I like promoting people I always have I always strive to find someone that isn't got millions of subscribers like yes these guys are all great they do fantastic content they do that's why they're there but do I watch them no, I don't watch them. I find if I watch anyone else doing the same sort of stuff as me, it kind of puts me off my own game a little bit. So if it's a one-off video from someone else, I don't mind. I watch it now and then. But if I, I couldn't watch someone like um, Slipcater every day, I can't even watch Loaded Crisis. I support him on Twitter. But because we do a lot of the similar stuff, I try not to watch him because I don't want it to impact how I do my things. So always, if you can, support smaller youtubers like i'm still small so i still need support but lots of people you know go and look out for smaller youtubers you'll find some great content if you're willing to go past the views and the subscribers and find people that have just got a little bit little bit more they're generally a little bit more hungrier their content might be a little bit more um just a bit different just a bit unique so big shout out to all these people here look, they're, they're pretty much my favorite people that i actually watch I don't have much time to be fair and I've had less time lately because I've been putting out more content um, but if I've got any spare time these are the people I'll watch and just a few couple people I really want to thank big shout out to big shout out to Missy Prime I was known as Jane really appreciate all your help she's like my right hand woman she's always there for me to talk to personally as well whenever I've got an issue or problem which is like a lot lately she's always there to listen to me and give me advice and I really appreciate that as well as being just a good friend to play games with occasionally Shout out to Laura as well and her daughter Rava. Laura's been really cool and just keeping me positive the last few weeks and that's nice. And a big shout out to my little boy Joshua. Joshua is like the reason I do YouTube. He was giving me the inspiration to start doing it. I talk to him all the time about gaming. We talk all the time about games coming out. I show him trailers for stuff. He gives me feedback about my stuff. You know, he's definitely my inspiration. Without him, I wouldn't be where I am now. And I certainly wouldn't be looking to carry on doing it as much as I can. Because I do it all pretty much because, you know, he inspires me. He talks to me. He gives me advice. He gives me the latest on what's going on, what people want to watch. And he's 11. But that's kind of a lot of my target audience is around 11 to 18. So, yeah, big shout out to Josh. Um, he's my little boy. I love him so much. And without him, I wouldn't be where I am today. And there we go. I've waffled on long enough. This has been shorter than the last video I just recorded. So, thank God. I'll be back, guys. Something special. Got a special video to celebrate 20,000 subscribers. It's coming out soon. I've just got to prepare it a little bit more. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.